Need a house? Call Ms. Mouse. By George Mendoza, illustrated by Doris Susan Smith. Meet Henrietta, also known as Ms. Mouse. Henrietta is a world famous decorator, which means she is an artist, a designer, a dreamer, a builder, a creator, all that and more too. You may have heard about Henrietta from your forest friends. Squirrels, rabbits, chipmunks and all kinds of birds know her. Even worms know about Henrietta. You see, Henrietta is a genius. Her head is like a carousel whirling with colours, fabrics and designs. Look at her, always at her drawing table, always creating for others. There she is, roughing out her schemes and themes, trying to change each creature's house, from the commonplace to the extraordinary. For hours and hours she struggles to, to find perfection. Sometimes she labours far into the night, without even thinking of nibbling on a piece of bread or cheese. But there are so many de demands upon her, so many friends to please. Thank goodness for her faithful little mice helpers. Imagine, Squirrel asks Henrietta to design a spaceship feeling in the branches of a knotty tree. Trout, beautiful brown trout, wants his watery underworld to resemble the lost paradise of Atlantis. Cat, lazy cat, purrs for lots of beds and wraparound terraces for the sole purpose of being what cat of doing of being what cats like to be best. Lazy. Better lazy as far as Henrietta is concerned than on the hunt for mice. Mole desires a more convenient and more luxurious way up to the top of the ground. Please Henrietta, an end to earthy entrances and exits for Monsieur Mole. Fox hopes only for a comfortable den, a place to relax after a long day's running and cunning. But Rabbit, being a most industrious farmer, asks Henrietta to decorate a hole to fill his stomach's delight. Lots of city people would like to live like Rabbit, don't you agree? Worm achieves the very core of his dream, thanks to Henrietta's extraordinary imagination. Bear, old furry bear, is so pleased with his, with his new cosy cave, he barely goes mountain climbing anymore. Lizard, crusty character, asks Henrietta for a splendid beach home, a place to enjoy the sun coming up and the sun going down.
Frog's leaping pad is a leaping success. Croak, croak. Spider's web becomes a musical dive with a magical tuned up beat. Beware flying gnats, moths and flies. Al, night's glider under moon's eye, can finally gaze beyond the lights of this world to the farthest star. Pig is so fussy, you would think she is the Queen of England. See what piggy money can do? Otter tells Henrietta, please build me a sturdy hunting and fishing lodge. As for Henrietta, she cares only for the simple life. What about you?